go to my YouTube channel. Welcome back. If this is very so oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. And if this is the first time of seeing these beautiful faces, don't make it be your last and hit that subscribe button and don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. Yeah, and on today's episode, we're going to talk about girl code. We're not going to be just thing and we're going to be talking about girl code. So without further ado, let's go on the board. So girl code, don't Take your breath down. Hello sis. We are not only going to be breaking tables, but we are going to be tackling some controversies mm -hmm. that deal with girl girls and what is that like. Yeah. I feel that before we can be able to understand girl code, women should be able to understand the code. Yeah. Because yeah. women and women like this, sometimes you don't like each other. Women. I think that's the first, code, the first code that women should like, girls yeah. should be able to Yeah, we should embrace each other, each other and all that. Support one another, women yes. supporting women. Stop Love competing. Yourself. Stop competing with people instead of just supporting your friends. And you compete with you when, you when money is involved. Exactly. <laughs> like it can be <laughs> it can be a friendly competition. Yeah. Down <laughs> those oh a big Should not make it toxic. Yes. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. Don't let you get to that stage. There's a line you should get you shouldn't cross. Mm -hmm. Exactly. I think women we are trying to oppress ourselves. That's why that's what is causing this competition among each other. Like somebody wants to post, oh I have this and the next person wants to show that oh I also have better this. than that. Then before you know it turns something like competition, before you know it starts saying all those beefs, all those That's a quote online. That's a quote mm. and you be like what's going on? <coughs> Everybody but, can relate to exactly. Everybody should be able to understand. Like it's just something that you even have to understand. Say, you have to understand that girl. You have to know that okay, I can't date my friend's ex. I can't. There, there are some things that you can't just do. You get. So, so what do you think about dating your friend's ex? Do you think it's right to date your friend's ex? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not. Really, it's not because that's why you treat. Like no matter like, no. what, you should even do that to your friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah even you can't if, really do that to your friend. Because I'm pretty yeah. sure you and your friend were bashing this guy together and yeah. she was always there when he fucked you up. So why would you want to do that? Yeah, it's really not proper. But most mm -hmm. of the girls now they do it. Like it's just they don't know what they they don't think that yeah. they felt breaking the friendship. Yeah. So breaking the relationship with you. Guy. And that's one part about girl code is like we should always choose ourselves first. Yeah, guys. Because like, guys always choose each other first. That's yes, it's like, like I never I break my God. But girls, oh, they can it's break girls so before. Yeah, so that's that's girl code one. Girls, babes over, over bros, over bros. Yeah, babes, babes over bros, babes over bros. My very <laughs> So if you find out that your friend is dating your ex. Well, your friend did not know that maybe it was your ex. Why is she my friend if she doesn't know who my ex is? Like, yeah. maybe if, she if she doesn't know who my ex is, then we are not friends. No, like maybe you guys were not friends when you and your ex were together. And all that. Like all these all these things, I see them as excuses. Like, like you, like your friend did not know that. Okay, I understand. Like, okay, I dated this guy in 2020. Mm -hmm. Then I didn't know her again. Yes. Then in 2021, I became friends with her. Ah. And then I later yeah, find out that she's dating my okay. ex. Now that is a completely different scenario. I have to be cool with it because me and that guy have been over since 2020. Oh, I'll be cool with it. I'll be cool with it because it's like I'm a new person in do, in that section because. I was not her friend when she started dating the guy. So yeah, basically, she didn't know. She did not know he was my ex. 
so you can't blame her because yeah. there are some guys that keep information like okay i don't want to tell my new baby about my yeah, ex they want to keep like the past in the past yeah so you can't i won't really judge her like okay the only thing i can do is when i see the guy yeah. when she introduced me to her boyfriend i'm like wow i know you <laughs> but some people some people prefer not to say anything yeah, yeah, but yeah. Not saying anything is a bad thing because it's like as if you have something in your mind. Maybe you yeah. still want the guy, but if yeah. if you know that you have nothing against both of them, yeah. you'll be like, ah, this where is my ex? So I know that, and it's all cool. Yeah, and it reminds me of a, a situation I've been in when I was in secondary school. Like there was this boy that we we're just we we're not dating, but we had intentions of dating, and when we got. To, in secondary school, I'm, I was really close with one girl, and all of a sudden, two of them were like, it was awkward at first, and it was weird. <laughs> it's always going to be awkward. Ah. But no matter what. You just have to, like, just, yeah. Girl code does not only mean, like, all this relationship, but, like, you have to smell good, you have to be nice. If a girl has good job, then, if you yeah. girl code to a person that will be a good job, well, it depends on the person. Depends on your approach. Yeah, yeah depends how approach. close I am with the person. Like, yeah. if if the I know my friend is a stubborn like, person that she doesn't listen, I won't. You can even bite. Like, you can even get that. Reasons. But some yeah. people see that as an insult, though. If you get them perfume, yes, you get them, exactly. you give them bologna, they're like, does that mean I smell? Yeah. Like, for example, the lapo has got you, though. I cannot say. Lapo. Which antiperspirant do you use? Which body spray? Which perfume do you use? And if she's like, I don't use anything, I'm like, why won't you use anything? Like, in this era, you don't use anything. That's bad, babe. Don't you know when you sweat, some odors and all that. You might not allow guys to approach you. I'm obviously hinting, like, babe, you are not smelling good. But I'm saying it in a nice way, like, so she can understand why it's necessary to smell nice. I'm not, I'm not going to tell her that, ah, that boy didn't smell. <laughs> 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 it's not it's about the manner of approach, how you approach somebody to tell them those kind of close things. Yeah. Maybe a girl is your friend and maybe you've known the guy before or from somewhere and you know, you and the guy had something together. You didn't date actually you guys you and the guy didn't date actually but you were almost like for maybe something else, you know. So you now saw your friend and the guy mm-hmm. together. How you think? My friend knows we that did. I mean, my, me and the guy had maybe we were in, like in a phase. Yeah, in a phase. Yeah, in a phase. Your friend knew. She might not know it's that deep. I feel the, uh, that. Me, for me, I feel it's consent. If she knew, like, yes, me and that guy to... talked for a while right. and I was thinking of dating the guy because girls, we talk a lot. I like this new guy. I am, no, I didn't even like him, but I'm just crushing on him and all that. Oh, I admire him. I would tell my baby, like, oh, more, this is what guy and all that. Fine, she knows about that phase. Then maybe it doesn't work out. Then the guy now tries to talk to her. If she likes him, I think the first thing she should do is talk to me. Mm-hmm. Tell me how she feels. Then um, if, I, if I, if I, like, she's supposed, she supposed to know, like, babe, what happened between you and this guy? Was it mutual? Did he do something wrong? Cause it's going to, if he did something wrong to me, it's going to help you too. Cause what he did might be a big red flag for both of us. So it's best you know. But if I'm like, I don't just really feeling the guy anymore. I'm like, you can go ahead though. You guys might have a connection or something, and that's fine. But if she does it without me knowing, then yeah, that's bad. You broke the girl code by not telling me. By not telling you. Okay. Maybe your friend is wearing a nice coat now. You like the clothes. You go buy like the clothes. Uh-huh. <laughs> you go buy exactly uh-huh. like the clothes. That one, I don't know. Is it, is it breaking this whole? <laughs> it is because you're crossing a boundary. Yes, you're already passing the line. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and that's. Like, it, it looks like competition. Oh, like. It doesn't look like it is competition. competition. Like, what would I do with this kind of air tight then? You got to be honest. You got to be 20. No, what's with your girl? For example, as I was like, I was going to sew a clothes then. Mm-hmm. Then I was just like, I was showing a friend of mine, like, ah, babe, what do you think about this? Mm-hmm. She's like, ah, but she's not keeping it to her tailor. She wants to sew it. <laughs> <laughs> I, 
I was just like, eh, hey. I'm like, okay now. I had to delete it because I'm like, I can't be yeah. like, if 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 I didn't pass it through, I'm like, okay, we want to and I just saw uh, so the clothes and I'm like, ah, oh, we have the same style. It should be like a funny coincidence. Mm-hmm. But I can't show, she cannot tell me like ah oh, people already have this kind of style, I'll give it to my tailor. Me say I'm not carrying my own big end. I'm gonna sew the same style. That's wrong, I broke the girl code because I told her, she told me that she was sewing the clothes so it would have been wrong. Like for we me. should we should learn to understand that women are easily offended. All these little little things they matter, like yeah, you don't want to. Guys, they're wearing the same clothes. Okay, ah, my bros, they're wearing the same clothes. Guys, guys, don't really have. When, when, when it comes to oh, one bed now, guys, almost all of them are wearing this um, article, selector clothes. But you see, babes, ah, different, 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 this, different, 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 this. Ah, my girls, my girls, they are. Wait, do you, you okay, girls? Do you feel it's appropriate, like, to just your friends, your like, private life, like? Ah, like because if we were to turn tables around for boys to just their friends about something that they've done in private about you you know it's not going to be fresh so sometimes i'm always like is it okay is it not is it first it depends on your girls yeah, exactly. your girls matter exactly if i'm and only, not too much Never yes. mind. Not, them, okay yeah you, most people like most much. people like big circles oh. like small circles but the other part is if I am um, sexually active and the three of them are not, I'm ah. I'm obviously going to feel away because I'm like, ha, how do I tell them all this stuff? How are they going to see it? They see me as a bad person mm-hmm. and all that. But if we're all in it together, I'm a baby. That guy, this thing, be like this so <laughs> I no rich deal. I he weak me. <laughs> Yeah, and those kind of conversations actually like make the bond yeah. stronger because you know everything that is going on with this person. They be like, ah, is it that guy? Nah, nah, this thing. Like. <laughs> <laughs> you be like, ah, be wrong, no. <laughs> I don't know. There was this particular movie like that. This girl, this lady was crying. I know you people say like she was crying in the bathroom, and she was like, it's so small. <laughs> I'm small. It's so small. <laughs> <laughs> I guess we're like, win hard or not, hard is too small. Uh, so, your mom was not right though. It's right. It depends on your friends. It depends on your girls. For example, like, when you get the mom got going this, like, when you tell her about the mom, I'm going to taste that too. No, why? Why? Then that's your bad friend now. Because there are some guys that when they hear how good their guy is treating them, they want their they guy. Want exactly. That's not a good friend. That's breaking a girl code. Going for your girl's man. Exactly. What if your friend tells you that she like she loves your man? Like she what if she tells that, you? What if she tells you? Oh, I want the guy like, like your exactly man. Exactly like your man. Like it's not cringy. Exact, like I exactly. want somebody like, like your man. guy. Is it, is it, is it, is it mm-hmm. problem, Jill? <laughs> if your friend tells that she wants one that is that like a boyfriend, it's not possible. No, no, I'm not. 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 i am not i am not i why if I tell you, ah, baby, I don't know, okay, I wish I had someone like your mother. No, I don't know, why would you say that? <laughs> Put in your diary or something. I'm no, I, 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 I actually think Some it's not a bad man. Yeah, you might just annoy the girl, like, ah, I actually wish you had, baby, I don't know, okay, I wish I had, like, your man. Hey. But, but you should know, like, if know I don't, like, I'm not close to your mom. But don't say it too much. Tell yeah, me you just once. Oh, if you keep on, if she keeps on repeating it, then that means something like, she going down. Friend, friend. Hmm. What if um maybe you finally got a boyfriend and you are happy with him and then this is a friend. Yeah, you and your friend are very very close, like very good. But first, you already have a boyfriend. You know, you know, really, you have to divide your attention mm-hmm. to your man, your friend, and all. And your friend is like jealous that oh, so you didn't have my time again. 
all at all. Is it is it right for a girl to like give her girls a look because she already has a boyfriend and not even have time for a friend? Like have your girls time. Like ah. Uh, Men are men. They are not stable. They will stay in your white. They will sit your breakfast. Uh, and you always go and meet your friends at the so end of the you day. Have to the so, so you just have to be there for your Don't leave your girls because you're already. Funny thing is that for me, for example, I'm actually more jealous with my friends than with my guys. Like, mm-hmm. Yes, when I see my very close friend, maybe with a guy or with another friend, so I feel jealous at that like. Uh, my baby has another person but if it's my own if it's my boyfriend and he has some other people he talks to or some other girls it doesn't really affect me like that basically i don't really care because i feel like i for some people friends go and come but i'm a type of person like i like keeping long-term friends i don't like changing friends and yeah like let's stay let's become friends now till whenever till whenever but boyfriends you know that ah, two months three months everything Scatter, but some babes like it's, once they have boyfriend, uh, you will not see them again. Like you're breaking people like school. me. You like, have time for your friends. They don't have time for us again. Have no. time for your friends. Don't uh, leave. Don't uh, leave your friend because but as for are single, because when you yes, come and meet us for our catches to wipe your. Teeth. I just have to go and buy you ice cream. At the end of the day, wipe your wipe your tears. Friends and because we found them now. Um, there's one thing that is actually going on now, like about a guy asks you out on a date and decides to bring your friend. Is it wrong ah, or it's not? not proper. It's not proper. How about you? But what you do? It depends oh. on the context. I say, it depends on how wide. It's an open place. Yeah, you can. It's not just letting your friend know your location. It is not going to. They talk about dates. Taking your friend along. But taking your friend along. Wait, let, let me. I, I have an instance. There was this girl, she just met a guy, and they said they look for night drive. Mm-hmm. Night drive? Night drive. Mm-hmm. It's like a date now. You're going yeah. to see the stars. Night drive, she didn't take your friend. She just said that intimate afraid. moment. You have to even be close. Because you and the person. You and the person that they you just met. Uh, how do you just meet someone that you're going to I went for night drive. drive. Night drive should not be the first thing that you should. Yes, they have talked on WhatsApp. They've actually talked online. How do they meet? It doesn't mean though. Oh, how do they meet? A first date for me, a first date should always be in an open place. Yeah. Not the night. Maybe like cinema. Yes, friends. Yes. 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 Yes.
Okay. Like a friend, my own friend. Your own friend. Tells me bad thing about you. About me. I come and tell you. Is it, is it, is it what was your response to the part that she said about that person? Yes. <laughs> yes. Like, no. so that we will know now. Because if she asks you, um, she said something bad. Look at her shoe. So, you what's your Abby. response? You cannot say like, Abby, oh, oh, look yes, at her shoe. You're not going to meet the, meet the other person that she said, look at your shoe. You cannot <laughs> say what you said, though. No. No, no, you so you have to see funny part. This happens a lot. So I say again, a lot. It happens a lot. Yeah, it depends. Like, what if um, Bola tells her something about me? If she tells me, I'm going to get mad at Bola. And if I confront Bola, Bola is going to get mad at Bola. Our friendship has obviously broken. Ah, yes. So. Well, if there have been any first scenario, if it was someone else, um, like the lab friend group, yeah, like your own close friend, someone else you know, uh-huh. yeah, maybe she just mess me one day, she not tells you something about me, and you tell me that I think that 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 one now is fine because I don't really know that person, so I might not confront that other person, but. I think it should be a nice friend to tell me if something serious but sometimes there are some com- there are some things that don't really matter. Like whatever no, Bola not mentioning Bola's name. Yeah, no, not even about mention. Whatever Bola must have told you. She told you with confi- uh, confidence <laughs> confidentiality. Yeah, yeah. No. <laughs> so I would I think it's best you don't tell me. Because you not telling me you're trying to save the group. Except it's, some, except, except it's something that you know is coming from a very deep place in Bola that maybe hatred or something like that. But you should be you should be the one able to know like hey, what Bola said about so how do I tell that? If you don't agree with Bola, you should. Tell if you know you don't even support it, you should be able to tell you should me be able that. To face her back. What you said is very wrong. Why you say that? Mm-hmm. After yeah, facing you, and if you are a good friend, it shouldn't reach my ear. Yeah. I wouldn't even I wouldn't want it to reach my ear because you have to say women supporting me right. Mm-hmm. To go with your friends or we get your friends to share with sharing <laughs> sharing clothes, sharing shoes and post on social media. So you know, is it girl like she'd be able to go with your friends? Oh please uh, your friend wants to it be a limit. But well, which is now my clothes? Uh, but when it is not post, you're not in our post again. That's not the one kind of. I'm not stingy, but. Uh, you're not stingy. I got some more video that, is, that I said online. Um, three girls with some picture. One of us moved it for the first one. <laughs> no way. You don't know where they first snap the first. I like the first one first snap. They moved the game. They come on where they snap that one. That, that, that one is fake life now. That one is fake life. Fake life. I mean, there are so many things. Wig is one. I don't think wig is something people, so many people should share that much. It is maybe your sister. Yeah, yeah if they are not your family, I know that it's wrong. But some, but some people are so close that they don't mind if we are the same size. Like I can borrow you my clothes. But borrowing your clothes should be in matters of emergency. Like I have a, I, I just had a court date with again. I'm like. But like, I have to sort this guy. I don't even know what to be. I don't even know what to be. Scatter my wardrobe. But like, I like, ah, I, I have this dress that I think will really go with you. I don't think it's going fits me anymore. The Bola gives it to me. That is women supporting me. She's helping me. She's helping my life. Then yeah, the other comes, ah, I have this mad shoe set that will fit you. You baby, you need to look hot. She gives me the shoe. I wear it. I know that. But I think it should not be something like she has worn so many times. Or share herself as well so many times, and I should respect myself and not go and take pictures and post it online because I know that what I'm wearing they are not mine, and the people that have it and I want to wear it some other time, I want to take pictures. So, okay, is it girl going to tell your friend that uh, boyfriend is cheating? Yes. yes. <laughs> I mean, sometimes you have to be careful because there are friends that we're not invited to have you. That's why your boyfriend cheated on you now. Ah! <laughs> no, that's not what I'm saying. See, girls say, well, I don't understand. See, if they tell you that your boyfriend cheated on you and maybe 
me and you get in a resort with the bag and food from there and uh, what's up, no monkey can separate us. I'm going to work and separate us. That means the monkey, that's what you're going to separate us. Guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, make sure you comment, and make sure you share this video. Follow us on Instagram pages. Let me show you my screen right now. And subscribe, turn on the notification bell. Respect the girl code. See you. Catch up. Bye. Bye.